So it would be yeah. this one. Here's your raffle tickets. Are you going to be here all week? Oh, yeah, I'll be here all week. Okay. Right. Okay, so then he's not going to need to. This target, I'm going to have to redo that thing. So I overheard that there's a transaction happening in Bitcoin right now. And the customer asked if the merchant would agree to the bit blockchain.info price, whatever they set it at. They said, yeah, of course, no problem. And now he's uh, scanning one of these scannable barcodes that uh, tell the user's phone what the address of the merchant is. So then once it's sent, they'll get confirmations by miners on the network. <laughs> I know it all sounds a little complicated, but if you see a few of these transactions taking place in Porkfest, I think you'll see them become quite common. And as the process becomes more familiar to everyone, it will be even become easier and faster. Right now it doesn't look like it's as fast as cash, especially because in Rogers Campground where we're staying, there isn't much connectivity, not a lot of Wi-Fi. So there will be people who are providing Wi-Fi for the purpose of Bitcoin payments later in the week. So transactions should be much smoother then. As for now, looks like it's much difficulty. I even decided not to purchase these bandanas that I got at registration with Bitcoin, although I was intending to. It took too long to synchronize, so I purchased them with cash. It's a brown one and a blue one, and they've got little porcupines on them.